Good morning everyone, my name is Jeeva Pagnya. I am studying in 6th class in Abhinav High School. Good morning everyone, my name is Diyakshita Sri. I am studying in 6th class in Abhinav High School. Today we are going to talk about waste. Every day we put many things in our dustbin. For example, after eating a banana, we put its peel in the dustbin. A large number of packed products like chocolates, biscuits, milk, oil, pulses and rice or packed in paper wrappers, plastic bags, cardboard cuttings, tin boxes and many other kinds of packing materials. After removing the product, we put the packing material in our dustbin. These are waste materials. There are two types of waste, biodegradable waste and non-biodegradable waste. Biodegradable waste, waste that can be decomposed by microorganisms over a period of time so that it cannot harm the environment is called biodegradable waste. Peels and cutting of fruits and vegetables, leaves, leftover food, animal dung, plants residue and agricultural waste are the examples of biodegradable waste. Non-biodegradable waste, waste that cannot be decomposed by microorganisms and stay unchanged over time is called non-biodegradable waste. Plastic, glass and metal objects are examples of non-biodegradable waste. This is important to separate biodegradable and non-biodegradable waste so that they can be disposed properly. For this, we use two types of dustbins, blue and green. The blue dustbin is used for collecting non-biodegradable waste. The green dustbin is used for collecting biodegradable waste. Problems caused due to waste. Biodegradable waste that is left in open causes bad smell in the surroundings. Houseflies and rats attracted towards it and they spread diseases. Non-biodegradable waste do not decompose, they cause pollutions. This is all about waste in biodegradable and non-biodegradable waste. Thank, Thank you. you.